Welcome to Area DMG. Welcome back to Area DMG. I am your host, Phil Fussy, the My Lie Mouth, and today we're going to try out a game that was, well, I think it was on sale, or I thought it looked interesting. I was just like, I'll check this out. Yeah, this is one of those things where it's like, um, you see it and you're like, okay, this could be pretty good or it could be pretty bad. We don't know. So we're going to check it out. I like the art style, though. There's our, I guess, our main character, Ashley Dengra. I guess that's her name. High school. Lives with shadow people in her high school. Yep. Look at the shark on there. Neat. Now she's drawing stuff. She's drawing homestuck characters. I don't know. Now we're focusing on a, a homestuck character's butt. Oh no, she's going to spill the paint. Ah, the paint. And now she's been transformed into her character. Now what happened is she's in a coma somewhere, I'm sure. Nope, but I think this is the plot. Yep, feathery ears. So, um, let's see what Feathery Years is all about. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a 3D game. Look. I'm using the, uh... Okay, right stick is this. We're moving here. Let's see, A button jumps. Okay, L button locks stuff in place. You can crouch down this way. Warp, 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 warp. Just clipping through stuff. Oh, I know, Maya. But we'll find out. We'll find out if this is any good. Continue game. Touch the blue light. New game. Find lightning spire. Options. Press the plus button. Oh. See the controls. Walk, center camera, crouch dive, camera lock, dash, jump, attack. Okay, cool. I don't have an attack. Hmm. Okay, this one allows me to dash. Oh, that's decent. Jump. Can we jump on the walls? Of course we can. Wall jumping. Bloop. Oh, we can swim. Where are we supposed to go? I mean, this is actually the first time we've played this, so there's no actual thing to continue from. Um, but I guess if we go blue spire, this water ain't too bad. Look at these reflections. Mm -hmm. A lot of clipping. Let's just explore a bit and find the blue spire. Is that it? Those enemies? I think those are enemies. But I can't hurt them. I don't have any attacks. Or at least I don't have any attacks at work. Yep. Oh. How do we attack things? Oh god, there's a lot of these things. Okay, so how do I... Oh. Okay, so I can cling to this? Oh. It's a shine! And what do I do with this? Nothing, apparently. Ah, so stuff is hurting me. And I don't know how to get out of here. I guess we can jump? Nope. How do we attack these? Was I not supposed to go here? Pretty sure I wasn't supposed to go here. Okay. Yep. Ah! No. How do I get out of here? Okay. No. Do I jump? Nope. Nope. Okay, let's try this. 
Nope, that didn't do anything. Okay, let's try dashing. No, up here. Oh, this camera control. This feels like it was made by one person. Was it? Um, how do I get out of there? Um, is there something, some way that I can go back? Am I stuck in this cave area? I think I'm kind of stuck in this cave area. And these things aren't hurting me, so... Now what? Okay, let's try wall jumping. Um... Or let's instead just try closing the software then going back in. Feathery ears! We'll figure this out. Black Rose Projects. Meager passion. Meager passion. I couldn't find, figure out what to do there. I just was kind of trapped. And now we're loading. Let's skip. Skip. Can I skip? Okay. So I guess this. We touched this, right? Alright, is this the thing we're doing? Continue game, touch the blue light. New game, find lightning spire. Okay. So let's avoid that other thing. Let's see if we can get up to here. I guess not? Hmm, right, maybe we have to use an advanced jumping technique like Mario. Yep, no. Okay. Let's try this. And up here. That was obviously not the thing we were looking for. Okay, can we go up here? I can't even use those yet. What are they for? Hmm. Obviously, this is not not something like. Uh, obviously, this is not polished, as you can tell from all the clipping and weird choices. So, blue spire. I don't know what those are. Yeah. Ah, boom. Well, we don't die from fall, fall, so that's good. And enemies don't seem to hurt us either. Um, let's try going that way. Good thing I don't take any fall damage. Oh, hey, things I don't know how to hurt. Why can't I hurt you? Oh, and they're shooting at me. That's lovely. Huh. Okay, so... How are we supposed to start this game? I mean, I, I'm i like, okay, I see what you're trying to do, but you could make it easier for me to actually, you know, get into the actual game. Maybe it's this one. Let's find out. Okay. Maybe that was it. We'll find out. I'm sure there's a cutscene. Thank you, shark. You are the creator. I what? Oh, crud. Ooh. Such a if. Ah, oh, no. Okay, that's that's not awkward at all. But hopefully that shark person gives me a sword and not the shark version of COVID-19 because that's obviously not social distancing. Mm. Bum, bum. Have a sword. I have a sword. Sword. I'm just going to show you that sword too. Okay. Huh. 
Now that we have this flaming sword, now what do we do with it? Spin around like they're in some kind of music video. That's a cool design, though. It's a, oh, it's a shark with uh, wings. And theirs are attacking. Yes. Now that we have the attack abilities. No, 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 no. Okay, no. Guess not. Now, let's go kill us some crabs. I don't know what we're doing here. Meh. Meh. Yeah, run from me. Oh, pfft. No, you gotta run from me, buddy. I have a big thing that... Boom. Wow, that, that's certainly using the HD rumble a bit. Yep. Hmm. Maybe we can collect these now? Can we collect them now? Oh. Yes, yes we can. Oh, that helps. That is such a good idea. Now let's go over here. And take these guys out. Hey, buddies! Guess who's back? Back again. Shitty's back. Tell a friend. Guess who's back? Guess who's back? Guess who's back? Nope, nope. What, now I can't reach it? Yay, now I got it. Now what? It's obviously doing a thing. Okay. Am I now trapped in here? I better not be trapped in here. I'll be kind of a little annoyed. Like, yay, now I've got them. But now I'm trapped. I... Maybe I can break something? Can I break one of these walls? Oh, no. We got that thing, right? Is that like a hint thing that tells me how to hint things? Hmm. Okay, can I break any of these walls? Or is this just a trap from which there is no return? Oh, I'll be so annoyed if that's just a trap. Okay. It's gotta be way out of here. Does this seem a little buggy to anyone else? Just a little. Like, not finished? Am I missing something? What could I possibly be missing? Hmm. Okay. Let's try running. Okay, this is our walk. Nope. There's got to be something I can hit. There's got to be something here, right? I mean, they wouldn't obviously release something that was broken on the eShop. Oh wait, yeah, they probably would. People would. Okay. Um. Oh, oh. Maybe I can use that. Okay, so let's try it this way. Okay, there's that. Boom. Okay. Got it. We're out now. We know what we're doing. Yeah. Y'all can suffer my wrath. You too. You flying whatevers. Oops. Crud, did we just die? Or, oh, I guess not. 
I wonder if you can dive all the way down into the end of the world. Yeah, you prismatic birds. Eat my sword. I don't know where my health is. I, I, is there something that tells it? Like, I mean, like, let's say you're playing, like, say, Spyro. In Spyro, you can look at the little, um, little, um, firefly thing that's following him. You can tell how much health you have left. This game does not seem to feature anything like that. Mip, 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 mip. Mip, 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 mo. Hmm. Well, now that we know, let's get back over here. I don't know what we're supposed to be collecting. I guess we're supposed to get all those stars. There's very little guidance, at least as I can tell, you know? That's fine. But at least the wall jump stuff from, like, Mario works. I love how that was, that's become a staple. Hmm. Actually, it makes me wish that Mario 64 were on the Switch right now. Please, Nintendo, do the right thing. Give me a remaster of Mario 64. I just want Mario 64 with Mario Odyssey graphics and a few other quality of life improvements. That's all I ask. Okay, so we got all those. Stuff is shaking. Hmm, are these zip lines? Oh. They are things that we can go on. Okay. Huh. Okay. Okay. Seems fair. Uh. Wait, let's just drop now. Oh, good. Boop, 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 boop. And done. Okay, that stuff's been lowered. I see one more that I could probably get. Whoop. Got it. Yeah, buddy. I kill you. That's how this goes. I see you jumping. I see you hating. Mm, dang it. Yeah, I saw you hating. I had to I had to do something about it. Hmm. Well, I I think we'll have to get to that other star. Yep, how are we gonna get to that other star? Ooh, let's see. Probably some way this way. Yeah, let's do this. Oh. Okay. Yes. Okay. I think we can get to that one, right? Woo! So this is glitchy as all heck, right? Look at that. If I were going to be like mean, I'd be like, yeah, this is completely unacceptable. But I'm like, nah, I feel like this is a very small development team. And it'd be kind of a little unfair. I don't want to be unfair. I mean, stuff works for the most part. The um, play control's not terrible. Skits, 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 skits. Hmm. 
How do we get to there? What are we missing? We want this. No! There's that over there. I bet that's a star. Let's get it. That, that should bring everything else down a little bit, right? Boom. Shine, get. Okay. I think what we're doing is we're opening up another portal or something. We are opening up portals to heck. Dun dun dun. Eh. Oh. Okay. So, I don't know what happened. I'm on a platform. Oh, here it goes. We're rising to the occasion. I hope that at some point you can use your, like, feathery ears to fly. We're in a new location. She has the power. Oh, hey, it's your friend who's probably not evil. So, this author character, I guess the character you're playing as, is probably passed out on the floor and it's kind of embarrassing. Likely just the uh, drooling on the art school floor. Maybe she's peed. We don't know. So, feathery ears. Ooh, new location. <gasps> Ooh, look at that texture work. Oh, boy. Look at that. Oh, no. Oh, that's totally an enemy. Of course it is. I'm guessing these rise up. Like gamers. Gamers rise up. Oh, duh. Away from me, uh, Tron butterfly thing. Shine. Get. Okay. These look like they're tricky jumps. Yep, that's a tricky jump. Yep, there we go. Oh no. These have physics. No. Yay. Nice. I bet if I hit those little things, they hit me up into the air. That's my guess. Should we go for it? Boom! Oh no, we died! Not really. But we got the, got the star. So, that's good. Can I get this this way? I guess not. Because there's that star... There's got to be something we can get for later on that, like, makes it easier for you to, like, get things like that. Maybe there's some type of ability you get later on. But let's test these. Yep, that's what I thought. I thought that they, they'd do something like that. Mm-hmm. Just like standards. No! Oh well. <sighs> oh no. Oh no. Oh wait, am I in a perpetual fall now? Oh wait, okay. For a second there, I thought I was going to have to perpetually fall. And I was like, really? Mm, among all these glitches. You know what they say, glitches get stitches, and so do snitches. So don't be a snitch, and don't be a glitch, and then you don't get stitches. Yer. Wait, was this the one I was aiming for? Uh, I kind of feel like it wasn't. Hmm. You know what? Let's do it. 
Boom. Is there even a game over status in here? Probably not. This seems like it'd be one of those games where that, that doesn't happen. Because they weren't sure how to program a life system. So there's none. Shine get. Mm, the shine of getty. No, 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 I'll fall forever. Well, what is that music in the background? Oh, no, that's something else. Anyways, this is something else. This is uh, Feathery Ears for the Nintendo Switch. And it's a game that came out. It's got some interesting ideas, but... Oh, does this need a heck of a lot of polish? Like, let's see, better texture work, um, better hit detection, some kind of guidance, better jumping. Actually, you know what would be nice? If the character had a shadow. There's a couple things they could do, like a, a shadow would be good, right? Don't you think this character should cast a shadow? Shouldn't there be some kind of life bar? Some kind of hit detection? I mean, it's a nice design. Look at this design. This design's fine. Big flaming sword. Awesome. Character design. Pretty good. Yep. Lock on works. But this feels like it's a game that's kind of half there. I mean, somebody's like... I'm working on this. This is my student project. And I'm just dissing their student project. Nah, I'm not dissing it. I feel like this is a pretty good effort. Do I think people should spend money on this? I don't know. I don't think there's going to be any um, patches or anything. Oh, goodness. Nah, this is oozing with some... I mean, the character... I feel like the character should be in a better game. I feel like there's something here. I really do feel like there's something here. It's just kind of hindered by like poor direction and um, it's kind of like glitches all over the place. Okay, let's jump over here. Uh huh. I feel though, as soon as you make this game like marginally playable in that way, you'd kind of like hurt it in some way. I mean, that sounds a little weird to say, doesn't it? It's a little weird. It's a little weird to say. Boom. Nope. Okay, let's try to jump into this hot lava. Yay! The hot lava killed us. Oh, the camera has um, presets that you can go through. You can go in further up. Oh wow, you can you can bring the camera further in. Look at this. This is nice character design, isn't it? It's pleasant. It's got some attitude. Like this character is going to fall on the island and kill the other nine people ninety nine people there. You know what I mean. But Yep, really? There's jiggle physics, really. That's where your phys that's where your budget went to, huh? Jiggle physics. Oh no. <laughs> there are other things that are a little bit more important here. Oh well. Nice thought though. Nice thought. He looks very concerned. I feel like. They spent all this time modeling this character, right? And this character model looks great. That sword is cool. It's clipping a bit, but this character needs a better, better like, world to inhabit. 
Yeah. I'm sorry, character. I'm sorry you inhabit this world that's so bleak and desolate and weird, and the music is kind of meh. Well, from what I've heard. Oh, wait. Let's try doing this. Okay. Oh, no. You can drop down. It's good. Huh. Oh, look. She looks genuinely terrified to fall. Don't worry. I'll be okay. What? Clip through the thing. Clip through the thing. Okay, okay, let's keep going. Oh man. I think someone thought like, hey, you know in Sonic games when you like jump onto stuff like that? Let's do that in our game. Shine get. Come on, shine get. Shine get. Blah! Backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up. Just like your daddy taught you to. Wow, that's a really old meme. I'm so sorry. People are like, what the heck is he talking about? Now look it up, the backing up song. They're feathering everyone up in here. No, no. Ah, oh, the internet is so terrible. Ooh. I should probably bring the camera back a little. Wait, how do I bring the camera? No, I need to bring the camera back. Okay, is that okay? Now what? Uh, crud. I seem to have messed up the camera controls. Okay, so I have to hold them down to get there. Uh, now what? Ooh! Oh no. Okay, wait, this seems good. We have that one that's in there that we haven't gotten to. We should get to it. Huh. Now what? I, my guess is when you get to these things, it. it Wait, I bet I can get on top of this. Yep, can I? Yeah. Are we making any kind of progress? Yep. Yeah. No, I guess not. Wait, yes, yes, we did. We did. We made the progress. Aren't we specials? No, no. We are specials. And the real magic was friendship all along. We're made of stars and pixels. Whoop, nope, 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 no! I'll just keep boosting till we die. Okay then. Let's try jumping. Yes, we got it. one of those games where like wow oh, okay huh okay let's do the little jumping trick that we did earlier to here like I feel that like if you haven't played Super Mario 64 or any type of um, 3d game where there's jumping and you're not aware of that particular thing you're gonna have kind of a bad time and you'll be like wondering what the heck how do I go okay now what anyways I feel like this is probably a good spot to spend end it in so this is feathery ears for the Nintendo switch what do you think I don't know. I, I The way it is, I don't think I could really recommend it. But I'm not really in the habit of making reviews unless I'm telling you it's a review. And this is not a review. This is just a look. 
So let me know in the comments below what you think. Hit that thumbs up, that share button, that subscribe button. Ring that little bell so you're notified whenever you have a brand new video here on Area DMG. I'm sorry, feathered ears person. You need to be in a better put together game with better physics. I mean, the character model's great. The world they inhabit looks like mud and garbage. Like, really old garbage. And that's a shame. Because I really like the little anime cutscenes. And I really like the character model. Eek. Well, anyways, hit that thumbs up, share button, subscribe button, ring that little bell so it'll be notified whenever there's a brand new video here on Area DMG. And until next video comes out, you are now caught up. Morning, Maya.